Hello guys, welcome back to Resident Evil. So, with the helmet key we are going to be getting some of the things we left out during the, the last episode. And we did leave out quite a bit. I'm really getting a little anxious to play Resi 3, by the way. Oh yeah, this room. Damn. Let's get this first. Let's get the grenade shells. Nice. Well, I probably have too much stuff with me. So, but but we are relatively close to the save room, so that's okay. Um, I'm just gonna try to. So what I'm really hoping for Resident Evil Three is, you know, uh, uh, I guess. Better character for Jill. Can we get it? A glowing red jewel sits in the eye. Yeah, take it. It's attached to something that and refuses to budge. Huh. What if I... What if I shut the switch? Wait. Oh, that was... That was with the lights shut off. How about now? Trophy of a deer. So she can't even see the thing in the eye anymore. So we definitely need the lights closed. Okay, maybe if we. Um, maybe if when the eagle is not looking at us, maybe that'll work. I don't fucking know why that would be. Oh! It worked! Red gemstone. Um, unfortunately, we are quite full, so I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna go back and dispose of the extra ammo. If you excuse me. Okay, we're back. We have some more space here, and let's do the other one. So why would, why would the eagle? Prohibit you from taking the, the jewel out. I'm not quite sure I understand that, but you know what? If I start counting the all the puzzles in Resident Evil that don't, don't make sense to me, we're gonna be here all damn day. Yellow gemstone. Okay, I got two gemstones. You mad? You mad little eagle? So I, I I don't I'm not sure. I used to think that the yellow one has gotta be for the tiger, but now I'm not so sure because I don't think the tiger has a red eye, does it? Let's go check it out. I guess now is a good time to to test test the theory. Great. You're not done, get up. Yeah. Wow. He's dead. I'm not going soft with you guys. Wow, the AC the shells really work wonders with these guys. Awesome. I don't I wonder if that's completely scripted or maybe there's always a chance of them appearing. Okay. I'm. I, I guess we'll be meeting more of them as the game goes on. Oh. Okay. I think I'll use this with you. Where is the tiger room? Ah. Go back for it. And he's on his feet again. So 
So let's try the yellow stone here. Okay, it fits. It does fit. So where do I use the red stone? Aha. Uh -huh. The MO disc. What is the MO disc? The mode operandi? I doubt that. Let's uh, examine it. It appears to be a disc for rebooting a system of some sort. What, Windows 2000? So this is probably pretty important. Okay. So, any other places we might want to explore? Maybe not yet. Maybe for now we just go back to the same room and deposit some of the stuff before getting some more stuff back with us. I mean, this game takes a lot of patience. And patience is not really my forte, but I'm surprisingly addicted to the mechanic of everything. Now, don't get me wrong, there are stuff that I feel a little bit tedious about. But not really this whole item management aspect of it. I actually think it's really charming. Uh, not sure. Before we do that, maybe we should check it out. Beautifully cut and polished. Well, jail that is uh, good to know, but hardly helpful. I also want to replenish the ammo a little bit. These are the bare minimum items where we taken out enough firepower to dispose of various enemies. The key and the first aid spray. I think that's quite enough to deal with most hazards. Most, not all. So let's go to the red zone. the right direction mm, it can be what I'm wondering right now is just the, the appearance of the hunters if they're completely scripted to me what's even more concerning is is there a limited number of them because if there's not, well, that's going to be posing a bit of a problem for us. Okay, so there's stuff here that I need to, I didn't take last time. I think some herbs. More than herbs, ammo actually. Ooh, maybe I should have brought the mag Magnum pistol with me. And look at that, battery. Well, I almost already have to double back. I'm not actually really planning to pl play this game again as Chris 
at least not immediately. Shit! Give me the fucking time to... I can't... I don't even have the time to, to, to react to that. Well, we, we opened up another space. Not in the way that I wanted, but fuck. I just I couldn't raise the the, the the shotgun and then take a shot at him. This just, it just doesn't give me that time. I'm not. Is there a dodge button that I'm that I'm supposed to have? There's an Oriental scroll on the wall, but a picture is Western style. Yeah, we saw that. I still have no idea what it means. The, the knob is broken. Doesn't like to open. Probably have to open from the other side of it. Let's travel down for a while. There really shouldn't be any enemy that I can't really take care of with the ammo that I have. And people usually say, you know, enemies in Resident Evil can, you can usually just bypass them. You're not really encouraged to fight them, I get all that, but I don't think Jill, at least not in this version, I don't think he's quite fast enough to bypass everything. Wait a second, what is this door? Did I see it before? Um, probably not. There's extra ammo here. Oh, I probably have been here before. I don't. I don't even know anymore. Well, let's get the red herb. And fuck that. Right. I think I think this part is done. And ooh. Yeah, whatever. I'm just gonna go back to use all the shotgun ammo and uh, go back to the same room to retrieve the magnum gun with me. Really? I see fucking serious right now. Where's the Where's the elevator? I thought it was Power supply is back online. Oh, the elevator is not here. Dummy. Well, I, I will never come back here again. Where's the elevator entrance? I'm just so disoriented by it, all the camera movements. So I really don't know if I'm ever going to come back to play again as Chris. I feel like I'm just kind of in a hurry to get to, you know, the Resident Evil 2 and then to 3. So I'm definitely not going to be doing that this time. But on the other hand, the best time to do a Chris walk, uh, not a walkthrough, not a, not by my level, a playthrough as Chris Redfield is like immediately after this one, or vice versa. I feel like I really feel like you, the best time to to use the other character is immediately after you just play through with the other one. Oh, a lot of herbs I need to come back to get.
shelf is full of dust covered uh, props and a dear trophy. Oh, wait. Why am I back in this room? What am I doing? Based on what I know about myself, I think I'm gonna have some extremely positive memories with this game. Despite all the things I'm getting wrong with it. Oh, there's definitely a, a, an innocent little zombie roaming around in the corridor. I don't want to have to disturb him, so I'm taking the long way around. is out of ammo again what is this battery really with this you can operate the elevator but I thought I was already operating the elevator where, where am I supposed to put this now I suppose there's a another level that the up that the elevator can go to well if, if that is the case we're gonna have to find out at a later time. Um, take the magnum out with us, I think. We still on uh, really using the self-defense gun I don't know if it's like really good so just a reminder what we have that we haven't used Mad of Ego red gemstone the snake serum um, what else the battery and the disc that's uh, about it. I'm gonna take out a green herb to mix with the red one. Okay, but I don't think I'm gonna take it with me because I'll be retrieving more herbs and I'll just take it from there, I think. Yep, that's a solid plan. on a side note if anyone's watching know that there's a lot of people watching these but if you're watching I really appreciate some feedback positive or negative also I've been kind of chopping this series to pieces just because there's a lot of retreading there's a lot of back and forth stuff and those are the, the, the kind of stuff that I would rather skip when I'm watching somebody else play video games so I'm skipping most of it for you guys. And I re I'm really curious if you like that approach. First of all. Now. Okay. Um, there's another herb here. Yeah, let's bring it. Now, where else should we go? This door is not going to open because this knob is broken. So it has to be accessed from either upstairs. Oh, it's gotta be upstairs. I know where we're going. 
I remember a particular door that needs a helmet key to open. And we're going there right now. And I'm almost certain that there's going to be some kind of obstruction. Why am I back here again? This door is just so enticing all the time. Surprisingly, I'm facing the right direction. So, if you you remember this, uh, this is the room where we got one of the other keys. And there's a close the door right here. Okay. Long corridor with a lot of windows, that's never a good sign. Oh. Um, I'll take one of you. And make some herb out of it since I'm using that space already. The other one's gonna have to stay here for now. What in the shit is that? Panic. Ugh, I hate these angles. What is going on? Oh no. Hell no. Oh great, it's following me. Hey there. I wonder how many shots it takes to kill him. Oh, it's I I mean tangled again. I have to use it. I'm hitting the Oh, is he dead? Please be dead. Please just drop dead. Phew! Okay, that put the acid shots to good use. I used the, all that I carried, but I don't regret it. You're dead, right? Giant snake got nothing. Yeah. I think the official name of this snake is Yawn. Who came up with that? Anyway, I'm gonna... First things first, let's go back for the green herb. <laughs> I used another, some more of my herbs. Shit, we just can't have enough herbs. Hey there, little buddy. Come with me with me. Good thing we're packing firepower. I mean, there are people who use nothing but the initial knife for all the enemies. I have no idea how they're gonna, what they're gonna do against the enemies like this. Um, how about some of the books? A collection of books on a broad range of subjects. There doesn't seem to be anything useful. I don't know. Have you actually read all all of the titles and decided that all of them are not useful? Maybe one of them is... Hey! Maybe this is the useful one. 
We will take the last book, volume two. Oh, well, uh, what was the? What did we get from the last one? What can the words on the cover mean? Eagles. Ah, oh, it's another medal, isn't it? Yep, we got a. This one is the medal of wolf. Found inside the last. Yes, there's gonna be a special way to use it. See, that goes somewhere. Or it may be Braille, I don't know. Okay, good thing that uh, the only book that's ever going to be used for for us just happened to have dropped from there. That's really nice of it. So we got an... Yes, we got to this room. I think we will be able to open it now. Where's the, where's the door? Oh, you still can't open it. Well, that just sucks. Guess we have to go back the way we came. <sighs> this just sounds like a trap, doesn't it? What I was really hoping to find up here was more ink ribbons. Yeah, I'm running out of ink ribbons again. This is not good. Do you think I could have maybe lured the snake over here and take the key and let this, the trap kill the snake? No, I would die too. So that was a boss that you absolutely had to kill, right? I mean, there. Could you maybe. I, I'm wondering a lot of things. Could you kill the snake the first time you met it? Obviously, I didn't. I didn't, I didn't even engage it the first time I tried to engage it, and I, I just. died. Plain and simple. Could you. If you had enough firepower, if you had a time, and if you were a better player than I was. Uh, which is not that hard to be honest with you Could it be done? I'm wondering that if, if it could be done well, if you could kill it at the time What would happen now? Who would appear uh, out of nowhere and Bump that book up. Maybe the snake just Doesn't die. Maybe it's like a nemesis from the original RE3 That it just You just can really kill it. You can defeat it temporarily, but that's all you can do. Maybe that's what it's gonna be like. Uh, okay. Mm, we have a lot of AC rounds, so let's pack some more. Oh, what was it doing? This is really curious is I can examine my lockpick. And I can even try to combine it with something else. I don't know, is there anything you can combine with a lockpick? Maybe to upgrade it? I have no idea. I have, I have, there are so many things about this game that I just don't know. I really want to save again. I'm kind of obsessed with saving, which makes this limited saving mechanism really work against me. I think I'm gonna save just because I don't know what's coming. This is the thing. If you if you're playing this with some context, if you know what's going to happen at least a little bit, you get some idea as to where the best part best part of this to save but I don't know I don't know anything about it this is probably gonna be a mistake I'm probably going to run out of ink ribbons after this one I will have three more and 
Uh, I don't know. All I'm hoping is that I will be able to find more in the next location that I will be exploring. Hmm. Okay, everybody ready? How's my ammo? Tolerable? So the next portion that I'm gonna go to, I think it's probably the only place we can go is um, first floor, east corridor. But just in case, I still think we should use the second floor to get there. Just because I have become more familiar upstairs and I know there are things on the first floor that I just don't want to see. Okay. Hey, where's the guy? There should be a person here at all times. Where is he? I never took care of him. I guess he found his life's purpose out. I, I will miss him. Um, hmm. Do you think maybe I should just leave the handgun? Behind, I've never, I've never actually thought about that. The original weapon. We don't really use it anymore because it, it, none of the enemies we encounter frequently right now can actually be taken down by. Oh, well, right, we have, we still have the basement to explore. But for now, let's. Oh, this is the last time we'll be using the helmet key. That opens up another space in the inventory, so that's good. Um, what the fuck? There's some kind of internal organ inside. You can't tell whether it came from a human or an animal. Hmm. There's something handwritten. It's not dated. Nothing's changed. I never thought that this room I designed as an experiment would pay off like this. I can hide here safely for a while because nobody knows about the secret behind this painting. Not even Sir Spencer. Painting of a mansion in the back of the art room. Uh, there are like numerous paintings of this mansion. Like, I, I'm assuming this is Trevor. Well, Trevor, you have always been really attached to this mansion. An elaborately fashioned globe. Well, that can never just be a globe, can it? Could this be a telescope? It looks to be pretty old. It looks to be pretty old. Well, fuck English, right? Mm -hmm. A portrait of a woman with a sad look in her eyes. What about this one? Oh, that's a lifesaver. There's some kind of internal or uh, yeah, I already saw that. Whew, that's a relief. I was getting worried there. Okay. Uh, nothing in the corridor. We we're moving on. Okay. <laughs> That's confused me a little while. Then I remember the game actually auto aims. Thanks for the little knife. I'm gonna check out the rest of the room before picking up the herb. Take the jewelry box. Okay, this I think this maybe is what the, the the red one is for. How about the green? 
Got blue herbs growing here. What about these grown herbs? Something's coming out of the, out of the mirror. I can just feel it. This is a disaster just waiting to happen. Let's see the map here. Maybe not. You know what? The, the room on the other side is actually completely sealed in. So maybe nothing will come out of there? Is that possible? Oh, by the way, the, there is... Definitely a, a hidden door somewhere around. Where can it be? The, the direction that I'm facing right now. That's definitely a hidden room. Is, this, is that about the painting of the mansion that Trevor talked about in his notes? Portrait of a woman with a sad look in her eyes. Um, actually, I don't know if this is for the the red gem. See, that's not a round gem, is it? Because the last jewelry box I got, I thought I needed something to open it and then it, it can just open by itself. This one, uh, no such luck. And that's an umbrella logo. Different color, but still the thing. So we got a glow. Oh, is that the same portrait? Is the, Are these all the same portrait of the same woman? If we will be able to solve any of the mysteries here. Not right now. So where else can we go? Let's check out the basement, because I know we gotta go to the basement at some point, and I know why we can't go in right now. There are octangle indentations to the right and left of the... Is that the, the wolf and the eagle? I think that may be it. I think if we... Br oh shit. I think if we may maybe we bring back the, the wolf and the eagle medals we can go to the basement. Do we want to go to the basement? Ooh, scary. I think there's something in. Wait, what am I doing? Oh, I remember this place now. Uh, I think there are dogs here. I barely re recognize this place anymore. Okay, no dogs. Oh, that this is the sole reason why it's uh, still inaccessible. But I, I can't really grab it right now anyway.
So let's go back to the save room. The save room on the east wing, anyway. Let's go there and uh, collect our thoughts. Open the jewel bo jewelry box and see what's next. Maybe what we really need to do is to go to the basement. Maybe that's the next step. And if that's it, I pity our chances. Okay. There's. I'm gonna just gonna equip this because things are not going to go very well with us. Full disclosure, by the way, I'm playing this like 4 o'clock in the a.m. Alone. I didn't turn my lights off because that would be mental suicide. Let's just say the vibes have set in with me. And I hope you and I hope you're doing the same. If you're watching this at night, shut down all the lights. Here, deposit this, the ink ribbon, you can join with the other happy little ink ribbons. Hey, you're a band of six again. Uh, where's the blue, uh, the red gem? I hope you're working. Here we go. Moment of truth. Oh. oh, okay, now that's just too much. Okay, I'm selecting a piece. Um. Can you rotate it? Dude, I really don't know. Um, I think this is it. Oh. Well, this posed a bit of a problem with the other one. the bigger ones. Um, I think this should be here. No, nope, doesn't work. Uh, then I guess it has to be here. I'm bad at this, in case you can't tell. This isn't here at all. But it does fit. At least I think it does. Could be for something else though. I still don't see it fitting anywhere but here. I think that the cross has to be at the center of the whole thing. That means I gotta leave this out of the way. I think 
hope it works. Come on, this is totally where it goes. Why isn't it allowing that? So it's really just a glitching problem, I think, that it just doesn't allow the pieces to fit, even though I'm totally correct in this. Okay, it's open. A brooch is inside. Well, that's there. In no way in a million years is that just a brooch. Oh, it's a key. Wait, an emblem key. The key is designed with an emblem of the Spencer family, whose history is as old as the Raccoon City. Huh. I think I know which door to use that on. But that also means. I gotta go back to one of my most dreaded corridors in this whole game. But what the shit. We got a firepower, and we're gonna use it. Now in order to get there, I'm finally getting a little familiar with the mansion. I still need to check the map every now and then. Okay. There appears to be uh, no simple way of getting there. We're just gonna have to brave through it. I'm scared. What, what now? What am I, what am I hearing? Shit, two of them. The fucking camera angle in this. It's just atrocious. Okay. Ace the shots work their magic. 
What were they doing in the bathroom? Do they need to pee or something? Uh, I guess they were admiring their own features in the mirror and they weren't ha satisfied with it. That would explain the grumpiness. By the way, I guess you uh, you simply would remember that I have actually come here before, but um, I I got killed after that. So that 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 that, that bit of a progress was not saved, and now I have to grab this again. I don't know if it's wise to grab it now since it takes up a space, and space are kind of scarce with us. This corridor, man, fuck this shit. It, it, it literally can't get any worse with it. Does not cooperate. No, sir. Well, I think we can at least open up another space when we discard the family emblem key, because there's not gonna be any further use to it. Yep, I assumed correctly. Show me your secrets. Oh, it's too dark to see anything. Well, I think that's a battery pack. I just want to grab it. It's too dark to see anything. What does that mean? Turn up the light? Yes. Let's go. Hey, metal object. Wow. Is that really just a metal object? Let's check it out. An object made from alloy, there's an emblem grieving. Uh, another emblem? Seriously? Whoa, shotgun shells, good. Uh, the contents are still intact, maybe no one's been here. A collection of scientific books, almost all of them are biology related. And another battery pack. Awesome. A collection of scientific books. I suppose that is all. One other thing, uh, the corridor to the courtyard, not the corridor, but more like a parlor. There's a uh, emblem still etched in there. I think we can retrieve it. I just don't know if we should. Well, anyway, we can take the shortcut to the save room and make ready for our next expedition. Soothing music. Now, here's what I'm gonna do. We got Mad of Eagle and Mad of Wolf. Actually, I actually don't think these two are for the basement door. If you remember, those are octangles. So that means, that means that they're for this. This and the other emblem, which I, I I hope, if I'm right, is going to be from the uh, from the, the courtyard parlor. And what would that mean? Oh, those are grenade shells. 
stupid. Well, you can join the other grenade shells. I just find AC the shells so powerful. Oh, I don't have any grenade shells. Okay. Besides, when did I get so many AC the shells? Then settling. I think I'm going to deposit my little handgun because it's just not very useful right now. Shotgun shells, maybe we can also take the shotgun with us. Okay, that's what it takes. The reason I'm bringing more variety of weapon with us instead of just more ammo is. Well, maybe we'll find... I don't know. We'll find more ammo out there. And I don't know which type of ammo we're, I'm going to find. So I'm jumping to a huge supposition here. Just that there's something out there to get. The, uh, the other emblem. If it is where I think it is. Which I can totally be wrong. I suppose we still can't go. just go back this way. Of course not. Wait. Wait a second. What, what did it just say? I didn't think we could go back this way. What the hell? What just happened? Have I been wrong this whole time? Okay, the crest fits perfectly. Yes! We can take the emblem back. Uh, which I guess locks the courtyard, but that's okay. We don't really need to go back to the courtyard. At least I don't think so. Now, if there's nothing else... How about we explore the... Huh. Let's go back the way we came. Wait, this door is completely fixed now? What really is going on? I'm, I'm confused. I need to check my recording to see what exactly that said. Because I've been avoiding going through that door. And it's caused me no small amount of pain. this as my default weapon just because I have more ammo to spare. Okay, basement. Be gentle with me. It's my first time. Oh, 
I was right. Come on, how precise do I have to stand? Wait, I took it back. What the hell? There are octangle indentations in the right and the left of the door. Just freaking use them, man. Okay, one, now the other. What is wrong with this thing? What is what exactly is preventing me from using them anyway? Oh, wait a second, is it? Is it because it doesn't have the stone part? Um, what the hell am I supposed to do about that? Yeah, there there are slight differences. This this is just a metal. This is stone and metal. So it needs the stone part to actually open the door. Well, I can't say I expected that. Huh. Well, that's interesting. And annoying. Let's not forget about annoying. What do we have that can fix this problem? Well, I'm sure I have no idea. So, to explore another angle, where else can we go? Courtyard? Residence? Mm, nope, it's definitely still in the mansion. I was kind of betting everything on the whole... That's a pickle. So guys, I'm gonna just go back to the save room and try to work that out. And uh, I think this is it for this episode. Thanks so much for watching. I'm having a ton of fun with this. Uh, especially when I'm making progress. This game is really special. It is, it's something special. I totally get why it was as influential as it proved to be. I really wish I'm better at it. I really do. But hey, I'm. I I feel like I'm just meeting one one obstruction after another. I'm just getting stuck at the end of every episode. But but we do make progress in every episode, so I take relief from that. So thanks a lot for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode where we figure out what to do next. Goodbye.